Wait, what, Krabby? The ammo cartridges for that sniper look like old DAT tapes or 8 tracks. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Reload. This one must have been Freebird. It's an extended mag. <laughs> Funny. There are so many of these. 1C55. So E9. 1C. 5-5. 1C. E9. So E9, 1C. 5, 5, 1C, E9. Excellent. Alright, let's figure out what this is. Pierced it, we're in. Couldn't ask the NCPD for better records than this. Pictures, medical records. Vulnerability to neuroplasticity. It's some kind of database. Brain scans, the paralysis biological casts, neuroplasticity. Jeez. Fuck. What about that? The blue shit. Fresh neural links. They're not spying on them, Johnny. They're fucking with their heads. Mean to say someone's literally controlling our upstanding politicians' minds? I mean, they change decisions for Red them, yeah. Our memory residue in the hippocampus region. See how they're bleeding into the blue? So what are we looking at? They're planting new memories in their heads, modifying their personalities. This is big shit, Johnny. Fuck me. Got other guinea pigs besides the paralysis, too. Quick, download the data. Whoever comes looking for it. That's your suspect. Shit! They're wiping the data! We've been made. Now they know someone's been in their database. Wonder mm -hmm. if they also know who. Well, I was connected to it. So, probably do. That's messed up. V, do you have any news? gonna want to sit down for this it's it's way bigger than we thought what is your politicians have now. personalities Literally. oh my god they've scanned your minds and now using some kind of conditioning to wait I'm not on the hollow right I'll come by no you and I we need to speak alone I know a little ramen place in Japan town sending you the coordinates right See you there. You're gonna betray me, are you, Liz? Alright. Ramen store, yeah. <laughs> Clearly gonna shoot me in the back. It's the only reason you take me to a ramen store. And meet there. Pretty sus. Oh yeah, wait, we got a message as well from River. Listen to that guy. How'd you read his chops? <laughs> Amateur hour. To my untrained ear, sounds alright, I guess. Easy listening at least. No why? Technique second rate. But the feeling? That's what counts. Guys okay. hurt, got something he can't take. And it shows. Could stand a little more stage presence. Fingering's all wrong, loses the tempo more than he keeps it, but not bad. Really <laughs> know how to give a guy a compliment. Is that how you got your start? Street busker with big dreams. Don't make me laugh. No time for playing my way to the top. Was too busy shaking the world awake. Okay, <laughs> loses tend to say that, uh-huh. Being at the top can be worth it. 
Want to shake the world, you know? World's gotta feel you first. And you pay for it. You spend your lyrics laying waste to the big record corpse. Who's gonna sign you then? But give up your ideals, and no amount of eddies can buy them back. All right, princess. At least you played some gigs. Saw those memories of yours. <laughs> True. Played where we could. Parks, old factories, underground clubs. Had an audience from the start. Some recorded our stuff, didn't even know who we were. Okay. So, you're saying some old samurai bootlegs are still floating around town? I smell heads. No idea you were such a materialist. Could almost cry. Almost. Chokes aside. You think those tapes still exist? After all these years? It's a random side yeah, quest you know, I bumped Rainbow into. is not far from here. Club we played till the band fell apart. Great spot. Place for people with their heads on straight. Maybe they'll know something. Okay. Thanks. Uh, anyway, let's look at this message. Uh, gonna visit Randy to the hospital. Wanna buy him a present? Got any tips? Uh, how about a new record? Yeah, remember he liked music. Uh Okay. How's your ride? <laughs> Tell Randy I said hi. Cool. Uh, thank you. Knock, knock. What's up? How's things? I'm good. Uh. Without spilling any blood? Oh, to do with the fight. I was going to say, like, what fight <laughs> was this talking about? It was the fight with the, the other dude who, like, got the combat personality stuff in him. Uh, sure. Yeah, still waiting for my code. Yeah, no worries. Okay, you're just checking in. Alright. Sounds good. Johnny, pretty sure they turned your great spot into a slurp shop. Oh, is it? Mindless a... fucking consumerism wins the day again. Point for the other team, huh? Huh. This is why you don't bring back fallen warriors. Huh. <laughs> Sooner or later, oh, this, this was the club that he went to. Now it's a ramen store. <laughs> Unlucky. Will you sit? Please? Look stressed. Thank you for coming. What's up? Uh-huh. I mean, obviously we're meeting here because they don't trust their apartment. Well, what kind of questions are these? Uh... Cozy little joint. Doesn't really match your style, though. But it's perfect for a one-on-one. -on -one. Sure. Here we are, then. What is it? Frozen has gone. I... I'm sorry. My nerves are shot. I can't gather my thoughts. Maybe because your brain's been taken over, but that too. Wasn't that long ago we last met. Something happened since then? No, I mean, something did happen, though not recently. Okay. It's a long story. I don't quite know how to tell you. Where to even start? How about the beginning? Relax. No need to rush. Can we order something uh, though? What's that? Uh, uh, a while ago, I started noticing some changes in Jeff's behavior. Uh huh. His personality, he seemed to be changing right in front of me. Becoming Weirdo someone standing else. outside. How so? 
He stopped reading? Forgot the title of his favorite movie? Even his musical taste changed overnight. Okay, so they're messing with his head. Yeah, you noticed it. Once, I said we should visit his brother's grave. And he told me that he'd been an only child. Okay. That's when I started thinking something bad was happening. Something insidious. And not just with Jeff. Okay. Notice any changes in yourself? After some time, on several occasions, my friends pointed out that I was acting strangely. Oh, that must have been hard. It was. You know, it's at times like those you start to question reality. So the whole time you knew what I could end up finding? I don't know who, how, or why, but they're changing us. Okay, so you... That concealed room in our apartment? What about it? I'm sure I'd seen it before, but must have somehow forgotten. Okay. So you had your suspicions, and now I this is confirmed. That terrifying. It. Mentioned any of this to Jeff? I tried. I did. But he's blinded to everything. He just laughed, said I was imagining things. Well, now we have proof, so... He once brought up a vacation that we never went on. Swear to God. Well, how do he you know? He went on about it in such detail. I almost started believing him. Here's the issue. Forgot. Exactly. Maybe they just wiped the trip from your memory. Hell, I don't know anymore. Don't you get that? Exactly. Both of you are unreliable. You don't know who's got the right information. Maybe he was right that he doesn't have a brother and you were wrong. Like... Because both of your minds are being messed with, so who the hell knows who's... And any for your thoughts? <laughs> who's got the, like, correct brain here. Okay, anyway, so, well, if you were suspicious before and he's laughed it off, well, he's going to believe you now because he had the same issue where he thought he shot someone and he did shoot someone and then they wiped it clean. So... V? Haven't told me the whole story Are you still yet, with me? have you? I saw a stranger in our apartment one night tinkering with the monitors. But I was in such a state by then that I didn't know if I could trust my own eyes. So you didn't do anything? I don't remember what happened. I talked to security the next morning. Okay. Let me guess. Cams didn't pick anything up. Yeah, because they wiped it again. The guy just shrugged and said I must have dreamt it. He showed me the recording, of course. I felt like a lunatic. And then, the next day, I got a call. Who was it? Them. Whoever they are. Oh wait, you even spoke there to them? There was a garbled voice on the other end. He never introduced himself. Bro, it wasn't just suspicions then. You, you like, got it confirmed. Why, why did they call you? They could have just like... Kept it as suspicions and shit. Okay. And then he you. Try to blackmail you. They said I was walking on thin ice. That if we kept stirring up trouble, Jeff could have an accident. Then they wiped any record of our conversation. It was as if it had never happened. So I'm begging you, V. Jefferson can't find out about any of this. Whatever. His life depends on it. I mean, what kind of life is it if he's not even in control of his own brain? What? You knew who sent the intruder, but just strung me along anyway, Liz? I didn't have a choice. I didn't know what to do. Wanted everything to just go on and flow on, because it was convenient. Convenient? My, I got the perfect life. Prominent husband. You don't lack for a thing. You think I'm having fun? You have no idea what it's like, living like this. Sure, but that means you would want to get out. What if you're just saying what they programmed you to say? Just reading off a script based on thoughts planted in your head. All I know is, I love my husband, and I want him to be safe, and... and happy. Or that's what they want you to know. <laughs> you know what Jeff will do if you tell him? I know my husband. He'll start looking on his own. Yeah. He can't find out about this. It... It'll destroy him. 
I mean, there's no way of living. Uh. But damn it, Elizabeth, you're gonna ignore this? Somebody poking around in your heads. Exactly. What choice do I have? To get myself killed? Or see my husband dragged away from me? Asking me to lie to my employer? I'm going to tell Jeff that SSI was spying for his rival, Holt. You just need to confirm what I say. Yeah, and if no. I'm not on board, you have a choice. Just remember, any consequences will not be yours to deal with. Uh huh. Truly prepared to fire SSI. After the threats, it'd be brave, but risky as all get out. What they're doing to us is one thing, but when you found that concealed room, I can't accept strangers spying on us while we sleep. Not under my own roof. I mean, they're what doing more than that. What difference does it make where? I'll take full responsibility for anything SSI goes on to do. I'm just asking you not to get Jefferson involved. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. I'll have a meeting in Reconciliation Park to Jeff's schedule. He'll be waiting. Since I can't know if I'll remember this conversation tomorrow, I'm counting on you not to forget what I asked of you. I won't. Yeah, but I'm not gonna... But that's all I can promise. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna tell him. Goodbye. But what do you mean? Whole thing's fucked up, huh? Yeah. Wouldn't want to be in her pants. Yeah, but speaking of corpo slave, overlapping memories, changing personalities, remind you of anything? Nope, not at all. But hey, at least we know what we're up against. Mm-hmm. No, no, this is different. Saw yourself. They're purposely modifying their minds' individual thoughts. Mm-hmm. Paralysis make a damn nice next-gen puppet. Yep. Even in my day, there were whispers about this kind of stuff. Cognitive pattern fluctuators, remote neural re-networking. In layman's terms, gaslighting. The beauty is that everything's fair game. Subliminal TV signals, high-density emitters in your electric toothbrush. <laughs> you name it. Yep. So, in my pants, what would you do? Some Tell real em. rat bastards behind this. Someone's got to take them down. Can we? Even by risking the Paralysis lives? Fuck yeah. knows what kind of shit a mayor controlled by puppet masters could pull. Exactly. But yeah, you could end up putting their lives at risk. Or not. Tough choice, V. Or didn't we get access to like the list of other people that they're controlling? Couldn't we, you know, look at that list and try and go through someone else? For example. Uh, meet with Jefferson. Do we have a... Fast travel? Oh yeah, it's that button. Uh... I mean, that's the thing, Lorang. Johnny is in our, <laughs> in our shoes, you know? That I get your check. 70% real blood. Oh. Yeah? It doesn't matter what you Whoa. tell him. It doesn't matter what you think of doing or do. You can't change anything. Okay. What? We know who you are. We know what you are. We know what you want. You are playing with fire. Don't dare cross the line. Show your face. Fuck. Well, you can go screw yourself. Oh wait, I should have stayed up there. Oh. Nice. 
nice. Found him. Hello, V. How's it going? Need to talk. Yes, I know. Elizabeth filled me in. Uh huh. Sounds like I was right to hire a professional. Elizabeth, what did she tell you exactly? Was she security Didn't detail? Specific. Just that SSI was spying for that son of a bitch Holt. Guess you got more though. Uh, yeah. SSI wasn't working for Holt. You're in deeper shit than you think. Meaning? Uh... They're in your heads, Jefferson. Yours and Elizabeth's. This some kind of chuckle-worthy metaphor? Strange dreams, partial recall, jumbled memories. It's not just stress and long hours. I don't know what you're trying to tell me, but I don't think I like where this is heading. Well, I mean, <laughs> you're Wake not gonna up. like it. Your brain's a mess. Messier than the discount section of a beady smut hut. I'm not paying you to make up riddles for me. So get to the point. I was gonna say, SSI's let's just... on the take of some unknown group that's out to control your lives. Liz. Laid out clear, like here is what they're doing, and this is how they're doing it. You know. No, there's a concealed room in your pad. Out with it. They've got tech in there you wouldn't believe. These people know everything about you and your wife, watching your every move. <sighs> Somebody's programming you and your wife. Sounds like something out of the movies. Saw your brain scans. They're tweaking your neural connections. This ain't no movie, Jeff. Been at it for a while with you and Liz. Editing your memories, your tastes, your views and beliefs even. How could I not have known about this? Your memories? Can't even trust those anymore. That's gonna make him insane. <laughs> it's not gonna, not gonna trust if, anything. If that's true. I'll never know what's real in my life and what's a lie, fabricated. Yeah. Wait, the intruder. I have to find him. Yeah, I don't know how you're gonna do that. Got no idea how we go about doing that. First, I'll find him. Then I'll find whoever's behind this. Pull the curtain back on these motherfuckers and show them what's what. I mean, I think the first thing we should do is find the head of security for the SSI company. He obviously knew what was going on. Like, he was emailing people in the emails. You know? Worst thing anyone can do to a person is strip them of their sense of self. I'd fight back too. They've made me a winner. <laughs> and they're gonna regret that. For now, I'll let them think they're pulling the strings. Good luck. My God, I have to tell Liz. Uh. Your wife knows everything. Liz? How? Figured it out at some point. Elizabeth? No, 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 no. She would have said something. Uh. She feared for your life, your daughter's life. Who could blame her? Nah. Well, she's never kept anything from me. And she doesn't scare easily, believe me. Well... Got an anonymous hollow telling her to keep her mouth shut. So she did what the perfect candidate's wife would do. Protected her family. I won't let them get away with this. Is there anything else I can do? You've done enough already, V. All that's left to do is wait. Or talk to the head of security because we know he's in on it. So what now? You know, Still call him over for a meeting and then we'll. Well, confront I'm not him. about to give up. I didn't run just to. Uh, I'll wait. 
from my window. An opportunity. Then make my move. Isn't that Bro, exactly what they want? They can shut your brain down whenever they want. Well, I'll give them more than they bargained for. And same with your eddies. Take care, V. Good luck. And good night. Hmm. So, thoughts? Hmm, somehow I doubt it's people who are behind this. So aliens. <laughs> Very funny. You're too young to remember this, but not so long ago, people talked about rogue AIs prowling cyberspace. So, not aliens. <laughs> Doesn't matter who. What matters is that guy decided to take up the gauntlet. My man. Yeah. Messed up. Looks like they're posing for a photo. A nice view, isn't it? Just some buildings. In a city tingling. Uh, aliens. <laughs> you know what? I want to go. What's fall on the hill? Oh, the tarot cards. Oh, oh level up. Oh, when using blood pump sideway for a health item, mitigation chance reduces incoming damage. Oh, that's cool, because I got that. Oh, I need to go sell some stuff. I thought there was a fast travel near here that maybe I just hadn't unlocked. I guess not. Oh. Ow. Oh. Dodging cars. Ah. Oh. Should have gone in the other way. I thought there'd be a way up from there. The stairs right here, though. <laughs> Alright. Let's go sell some stuff. To Vic. Actually, I'll dismantle a lot of the gold and purple, because then we can... Use those for crafting components. Um, but before I do chat, I'm going to take a quick break. Be right back in a couple of minutes. Thank you for hanging out. Appreciate it. Be happy. Alright, I'm back. Sorry about the wait. Oh, we're getting a call. Hey, Perfect B. timing. Michael called. Before sundown. Out front of the mega tower. Gonna okay. Be there? Of course I will. Sure. See you then. Sounds good. Alright. Excellent. Uh, so what I want to do... Is sell all this junk. Also... I just remembered, I want to talk... To what's his name? And I tell you, no! The Arasakas are no ordinary clan! They're not even human! Vampires belong! Gerald Winkler? Is that his name? Anyway. We're going to talk to him next time as well. Um, but I actually have to get off, sorry. And I tell you no. the so we're going to get off now, and when we come back, he will sell all our items, talk to Gerald. Seriously, I don't remember that name. But we'll do that, and then we've got a few more quests as well. So we can... Wait, what's this? Oh, is this the name of the quest? Okay. Yeah, we want to do that one. 
don't know what these other ones are. Oh yeah, carry. Yeah, yeah. All right. Anyway, sorry about ending abruptly, but thank you for hanging out. Appreciate it. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day slash night. Bye.